<laughs> oh, oh, fuck, I lost them. Uh, yeah, you're gonna have to watch out for that. The approach to <laughs> the swimming pool, I hit the wall. Yeah, I've just, uh... That's, that's like my warning shot. It always happens. In practice, for Monaco, I always yeah. hit a wall or something, or crash, but then in the race, nothing. Yeah, I, I just do the opposite. I don't crash anywhere apart from the race. <laughs> as you could clearly see from the last two episodes. <laughs> You don't get like the instant like mid corner gro Oh, I did what you did. Oh, you're gonna be set for the race then. <laughs> <laughs> Just I was about to say it doesn't have the same mid corner grip. I lose it mid corner. So right now at the moment, Ferrari are one on 150 points leading the way. We're second, 117, and then Williams are third with 92. So we've got quite a nice gap to Williams. Ferrari are 1-2 for the race again for Monaco, so really, we've got to try and come 1-2 somehow. What's up guys, and welcome back to another co-op episode. This is round number 6, the Monaco Grand Prix, the marquee event of any given season, but here we are for the 6th round of this championship. And as always, here's my partner in crime, Arav. What's up guys? Yep, yeah, we're here at Monaco, the one with the barriers. I say that because that will probably be one of the most important factors of this race if me and Ben do crash. Um, judging by my performances from last last few rounds, uh, that may be a big possibility. But uh, as we hopefully would have cut in at some point, we've got quite a big fight with Ferrari at the moment. We need to try and get a 1-2. We just, we just need to do it. We need to do it. It's going to be so tough here. The, the AI is going to be like a car park, basically. Yeah, it's going to be so hard to get through the pack. I'm just thinking up a little race strategy here that's going to get me to the front. Maybe go on options and stop early, but I don't know. The Prime's uh, stint has been working really well for me starting on the Prime. So I, I honestly don't know what to do, to be honest. So we just, yeah, we just, well, we just as, need to gain as many positions on the first lap as we can, really. Yeah, we need to stay out of trouble and gain many positions. And basically then we can just go on, hopefully with some clean air. But if you're new to this series, you don't know what's actually going on. Basically, as you can see, we're both in the Mercedes cars. And we're starting from the back, so P19 and P20, without any setup. So we're doing default setup. And uh, yeah, that's going to make it very, very tasty. If you have missed any of the previous episodes, there uh, are five before. Then you can go check them out. But uh, we are ready for the race. Let's go yes, to the Monaco are. Grand Prix. Oh boy, good luck, Arab. I think we're yep. going to need it. To you. <laughs> yeah, look up to you. Five red lights. There's a yellow flag even before we started. Did you notice that? <laughs> nah, it didn't come on my screen. didn't come up. Oh, oh, oh this the has man been is, a nah, tremendous I'm staying start. Out of it. I'm tremendous. staying out of it. I got a horrible start. The man has started weaving around like mad in front of me. Right. Um, I'm going to just take it. Oh! Nice and <laughs> I had no choice. I got squeezed. I got squeezed and Did button you lose got squeezed. A bit of front wing? No, Hulkenberg's lost his front wing. I'm good. I'm good. I thought I'm you good. may. I thought. Oh, good. I thought you may have lost some because I saw some debris, but that was Hulkenberg. That did not look pretty from my view right behind. <laughs> no, we we both got squeezed at like the sharpest point of the the straight, and oh, right. uh, I can't remember who it was, but they did not fare well <laughs> out of yeah. that encounter. <laughs> yeah, Hulkenberg completely just got Hulk smashed into the barrier. <laughs> No, that wasn't me. There was someone else. Uh, yeah, I was think it was, oh, there was there was also McLaren um, yeah, that also thinking, broke his front wing. I was thinking wing. Jensen yeah. Button. Jensen Button. Yeah, yeah, got yeah. Spun those those two too. now without any front wing, so they're behind the field now. And Perez looks like he's trying to fend all he can from you. <laughs> yeah, trying to size up his car and seeing where his strengths and weaknesses are at the moment. I don't want to dive in too early. Still a lot of yeah, laps. I'm just taking it easy, learning the track a little bit. The understeer is quite a lot because with default setup, we were talking about this just before we actually started the video. It there's there's just a lot of understeer and lack of grip without any sort of setup around Monaco here. Gonna have to get used to it as I've broke. Oh, frick's sake! I've just spun a little bit into the wall and I've lost a bit of my front wing. Wow, I might pit and I'm on prime tires. Oh, I've, that's, oh mm. that's gonna that's gonna muck me up. The understeer is so bad, I can't actually even keep up with you anymore. I can't even see you anymore. Oh, that sucks. Trouble finding a way around Perez at the moment. Trying to get a clean move on Perez. Even though we're in a Mercedes, we've got good straight line speed. We're just on the slower compound, and it's just keeping the AI in front oh, of us. At the moment, there's a massive up. crash in front of us. Hulkenberg trying to get in front, trying to get out of the way of everyone else. He's going to be going slowly. Someone. Yeah, I'm just ahead. ghosting through him. I think someone up ahead's lost their front wing, or oh, they're dead. Definitely going a little bit slower and holding up this pack here. Around the outside of Perez into Raskas. Oh boy. 
we've got him on the traction. Leave him space through the final corner, the hand gets thrown up and we've got him. <laughs> right, I'm in the pits. I'm in the pits. This is going to be a longer Grand Prix for me. I'm going to have to do a lot of concentrating and fighting. <laughs> yeah, the concentration be... levels are, are really Yeah, I'm going, to be, I'm going to be in sweat mode. For this episode, I may not... Ben might be doing most of the talking here <laughs> if he's in the pack because I'm just going to concentrate on lap time pretty much because I'm literally by my own now. Oh, just hold them behind me. Stappen. Inside front lockup and around the outside through the Lowe's hairpin. Get that into you. Oh, no, he, he gave me some back. <laughs> what do you want to say? Get that in your. <laughs> <laughs> that was brilliant. Like midway sentence, just cut off by him coming back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a street fight here. Street rules. Anything goes. I Maybe reckon. I can. Uh, I think this. You know what? This might just turn out to be like a more of a team race for me because I think I could help you out then because I could back the pack up if I get ahead of them. Yeah, that's true. Up the inside of uh, Salba. Uh, Bad news. Yeah, Houston, we have a problem. So, uh, me and Ben are going to be fighting for the wooden spoon today. Oh, I've got to hit up the backside from Verstappen. He's back for some more. You clearly wanted some. <laughs> you needed to give it to him now. Oh, Jesus. I'll give it to him later. I catch up to him on, on options. Into the pits we go now. Fr change of front wing. Let's test out how good these Mercedes pit crew are. Five, six, seven, eight, eight point six. Yeah, that's pretty much the same as mine. Yeah, here comes Arav. I think you're going to rejoin in front of me. So this will be a team race. Both of us trying to get back through the field. You're in a good spot, by the way. Once everyone pits, you're going to you're going to be well inside the top ten. 16-1. Not bad. Not bad for a number two driver. <laughs> Jesus, 159. Pulling the times out. Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Look at this cocky son of a bitch. <laughs> Sorry. I have to be modest. I'm in P18 right now. <laughs> Can't get ahead of myself. I see a flag came out. <laughs> Nothing happened. <laughs> okay, then. Did uh, we have a little bit of contact with Jensen? Jensen Maybe. Jensen stuck his nose in some business he shouldn't have got involved in. <laughs> <laughs> Up the inside of Mary. Into... There, was a, there was a corner there, and he had no right to it. Why is it every time you overtake, there's a yellow flag? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's just a happy coincidence. <laughs> Cars are in the pits. Cars are in the pits. This is gonna, about to get interesting now. Finally, <laughs> some action. Maldonado, let's get in front of him, shall we? Uh uh. No, no, Maldonado, bad. Good boy. Down the inside of Science. Oh, what a move. Down the inside into the casino square. Job done. Come on, Kivyat. Come on. Let's, let's be rational about this. Come on! This is a negotiation. I want your position. I'm, I'm taking up. I will not take no for an answer. I'm, I'm taking it peacefully by force. Overtaking the AI is so much more on edge when you do it in co-op because the AI, because of the lag, is just uh, they're a little bit. They're an absolute just, bitch. There's no other word for it. Don't squeeze me. Give me some space. That's oh, what I'm talking oh, about. Oh, I made the exact same move. I did on Perez to Bottas. Can you stop putting cars between us, please? As soon <laughs> as I get in front of someone, you overtake the next car. <laughs> think about it. If you pit now, do you think you'd get this track position back? I think you might be better I don't off. know. I can't really say. Honestly, I don't think so. Because even... Because I haven't been able... Oh, I've just hit the pit wall. No. No. I, I've, but I'm still behind you. Have you but, lost any front wing? No, no, I'm all good. Oh, oh, you prick! You prick! Someone just hit me on the back. I didn't even do that. That was my fault. I broke a little bit earlier, just a bit of caution, and they smacked me up the rear, and I'm pretty sure I accelerated a bit, and I'm straight into turn one. 
No front wing. Oh. I'll just do an entire lap. No, it sounds like Grosjean on Verstappen. The crash oh. they had. Oh, and then someone's now hit me because I'm going slowly with no front wing. Oh, no. And that's my race over. No points today. Can't be. Because they're now all hitting me. They're all... Do you have any consideration, AI? I'm fucking without a front wing. Just be patient. They have no chill. No they chill have no chill. They just hit. The, I, I didn't. I didn't know what you meant when they were like, "Oh, they just hit me straight in the back." But no, yeah, they have no chill. They just hit you, spin you out, and then you ghost eventually, and then they overtake you. Brilliant. Speaking of overtakes, around the outside of Bottas into no. He's got. He's got me covered off. Oh, once again, I'm actually getting so pissed off in these co-ops. Because once again, I pulled off some really nice moves earlier in the race. And then it all just goes to utter shit. Yeah, he did so well. Uh, uh, the inside of Bottas. Thank Jesus for that. Into P4. Yeah, you've had some really bad luck lately. It's just... The uh, last three races, basically. I mean, I know partly because I haven't been playing this game at all, apart from when we record. But genuinely, this race, I was driving just normally, like, at my usual level. Made some nice moves. And then that was just very, very unlucky. To the pit wall. Pit walls happen to so many people. You know, just so easy to hit that. But then afterwards, I don't even know what happened. I'm going to have to look back at the footage. But I'm pretty sure I accelerated after I broke completely for the corner. Which means someone hit me. Well, I'm down in 19th. No way I'm getting some points now. You know what? I'm going to I'm gonna take one for the team, even though it will mean that I'll be even lower in the championship compared to you in terms of the gap, which uh, will pain me to see, but I, I need to take one for the team here, for the constructors. <laughs> I'm going to slow down considerably and do a little bit of... Uh, a little bit of Chelsea FC here. A little bit of uh, park, park the stadium, park the bus, park the shop. Lock the shop up <laughs> and uh, throw away the key. Oh, shit. <laughs> I don't know what to say. And the Ferraris are right behind me. Hey, lads. <laughs> hey, lads. Nice to meet you, lads. Blue flag. Fuck off. The AI don't do it. The AI don't do it. I won't do it. Yeah, that's true. Hey, lads. How are you doing? How are you doing? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to park it here at Swimming Pool. Just lovely. Nice little... Slow parade we're having here. Oh, Raikkonen. Oh, Raikkonen took me out. Oh, oh, oh. That, um, Raikkonen took me out. Right, well, back to another set of, uh, another set of tyres, another set of front wings. Uh, I think that's, I think that's four front wings so far for the entire Mercedes team. So they're going to be running out soon. They're going to need to <laughs> make shift a front wing on the spot for when I'm next in the pits. I'm actually scheduled to come in in two more laps. I think that's the, the plan here. I lose a front wing in the next two laps as well. Um, okay, so uh, take two of trying to uh, slow the Ferraris down. Drive till the Ferraris explode. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. I can see the comments now. Oh, why did you hold them up? No fun. It's not realistic. <laughs> <laughs> And, and and don't think I know that you right there. Yeah, you. I know you're writing that comment right now. Do it. I dare you. I Having a little you're, you're, uh, issue you're with done. Sunday driving at the moment. I'm uh, being road raged by Ferraris at the moment. Uh, I've lost half my front wing. Uh, I'm still alive though. Still on the Sunday drive. I I will deliver these kids to school. <laughs> that was like the the the, the owner of the daycare center. Yep, I've got no front wing now, so it's See all you up like to you, buddy. I've done as much as I can. Oh, Massa, Massa's stuck behind Raikkonen, and Raikkonen's going slowly. What's the deal here? Has he got damage? I'm not too sure. Oh, Massa. oh Vettel just smashed me in Raskat. Oh, I've no. Got a oh, my. God. I'm in the pits. I'm in the pits. I've got everyone's, a puncture. Everyone's gone slowly, and I've just moved into the lead of the Monaco Grand Prix. With two That's how you do it. Oh. That came out of nowhere. Wow. <laughs> Unbelievable. I thought Raikkonen lost his front wing. He was going so slowly. Turns out he's absolutely fine. And Vettel was the one who was yeah, in no, trouble. No. V Vettel smashed into me and Raska. So you actually... I don't know what happened to Raikkonen there. Whatever happened to him was between him and Massa. Because I was actually fending off Vettel. And he smashed me into Raska. He, had, he, was, he, was, he just had enough of it, basically, by Raska. Yeah. Yeah. Raikkonen just went super cautious and... 
they all got out of the way and I took the lead. Okay, so we now leave Raikkonen from Massa. We're at 0.084 down on fuel. It's time to go in ultra fuel con mode and just pop this thing home to the finish. I'd just like to give my Felipe Massa official speech. I think that's what they call it when you take one for the team like that. Um, you're welcome and um, fuck you, Ferrari. It's all right. I'll, uh, when we get on the podium, I'll, um, I'll let you stand on the top step like uh, <laughs> Barrichello and Shumi. I actually can't believe this is happening. <laughs> I'm going to love the comments on my video. They're going to love me. <laughs> <laughs> I took one for the team and stop being so sassy and taking it too seriously. It's a game. <laughs> We're playing co-op <laughs> on a very broken game. Why well, do you have to be mad? Uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I took one for the team and now <laughs> Ben is going to win the race. Oh, we don't know that yet. I'm still 0.4 down on fuel. No, 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 no. You have to win the race now. There's no <laughs> way. You, if you don't, I'm going to take a flight to Australia just to strangle you for not winning the race. Yeah, okay. okay. Um, we're 0.4 down, and there's not much left long in the race. Just taking this ultra cautious now. Point, down to 0.3, 5, 3, 4. <gasps> <laughs> Raikkonen's, Raikkonen's hit the wall! He's hit the wall! That's gonna that's gonna win me the race! But no, Mass has got in second now! I've run out of fuel, I ran out of fuel, I <laughs> in the middle sector. Okay, here we go. Let's just Park put it, this... park it, park it! Use the Sunday drive skills! <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, let's go. Check and flag. Massa, Massa, Massa! No! Fuck! No! No, <laughs> I did do some defensive maneuvers, and uh, he just got me over the line. Oh boy! <laughs> I came twentieth for this bullshit. <laughs> Thanks, Massa. Thanks. <laughs> and here I come, twentieth. No points, and probably severely down in the drivers' championship. Great, great. I don't believe that. I honestly don't believe that. I saved so much fuel, and I couldn't even hit the wall on the final lap. I thought that was it. That was my ticket to victory. Yeah. But no. I think we still right. might gain on the Ferraris. Yeah, yeah, we will. We will. Massa will uh, also gain on them a little bit. So we'll obviously we'll put the table up after the after the episode's done. So we'll see. I'm probably going to have a very depressing gap to everyone, which I'll have to try and make up eventually. But um, yeah, <laughs> but Massa, Ben, Bottas, very good race for Williams. Williams will definitely jump us in the constructors actually, but overall we both will have gained on Ferrari, and in the drivers you'll definitely gain on at least Vettel and uh, a little bit of Raikkonen. <clears throat> And yeah. I'll just lose on both fronts. <laughs> but uh, that's been a very interesting episode of co-op. Don't take these things too seriously. I'm just going to say that. I know there will be people that do take it seriously. But seriously, guys, don't. We just have a lot of fun with this. And uh, I think we actually did this two, two seasons ago in our very first co-op season where I think we did the same sort of thing. I tried to back the pack up when we were in the McLarens in 2013. I think this is sort of a throwback to that episode, but... Yeah, nonetheless, if you did enjoy that episode, <laughs> leave a like. Comment below what you thought. There's probably inevitably going to be lots of comments <laughs> saying, why the fuck did I do what I did? But you know what? It's a Friday. I've just finished lectures. I've got half a day to do nothing. I just wanted to enjoy myself. But yeah, I'll leave Ben with the final words. But thank you guys for watching, as ever. I know how much you guys do enjoy the cult when they eventually come around. Uh, yeah, I'll leave the final words to Ben. Yep, guys. That's been a very memorable episode. No matter what way you look at it, we've come second. Only just one tenth was the margin to Felipe Massa. We've had a lot of instances over a lot of my videos where we won the race at the, the last, you know, straight or whatever. But we've been on the receiving end of that now. And, uh, you know, that's just how it goes sometimes. Go check out Araba's point of view to see what went down in his uh, career. Sunday uh, drive. <laughs> Sunday drive episode, I'm sure. There was a lot of uh, 
action on his point of view. So <laughs> go check him out. Leave a like on both of our videos if you enjoyed. And the next race, I'm not too sure what it is. I think it's either Canada or Austria. No, Canada, Canada. It will Canada. be Canada. So Canada is usually quite a good circuit for mine. So I think that could be my comeback race. But a lot of long straights. Hopefully our car will be really good. Yeah, straight line speed OP is to come in the ne next episode. So until then, guys, we'll see you next time. <sighs> that prick massa, oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, I weaved to the middle and he's just <laughs> he's he's done some kind of daredevil move right around the outside up against the wall and into first place. Yeah.